the Prince of Dark Matter, has arrived. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from the fifth dimension. Weighing in at 220 pounds, Stardust. We thought that Cody Rhodes had finally shed this skin, but it's once again consumed the American nightmare. Well, Cody has always had a penchant for the bizarre, and it has once again returned from the furthest reaches of the cosmos. It's brought him success in the past in the form of the WWE tag title, so who knows what it'll do for Cody this time. I'm feeling the chills up and down my spine that come with the arrival of the Dragon. This is a point from Honolulu, Hawaii, weighing in at 235 pounds, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Fellas, we are in for some vintage WWE style action. Hey, wait a minute. Sorry, I'll throw you a couple bucks. Excellent physical conditioning for the Dragon. Yeah, if there is one guarantee with Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, you know that the Dragon is always ready to deliver. The bottom line is, this is going to be good. throwback. Cody Rhodes has brought out Stardust. Now, I don't know if this is an attempt at mind games for Cody or if his own mind is unraveling. We all thought Rhodes had put this part of his career in the rearview mirror. There's a term in our business called living the gimmick and to me that is what Cody is doing as Stardust. And on the opposite side is a fire breathing dragon. Steamboat defends the virtues of truth and hopes to inspire the WWE Universe to be the best they can be. I think Steamboat should reevaluate his priorities, but I'll say this, it'll be a cold day in hell before Steamboat backs down from a challenge. Oh, oh. Hip drop. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Headbutt to the back of the neck. What a chancery. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Taking flight. Bang, what a splash. That blow might be a test to Stardust. Steve making that look almost effortless. That was a long two count there. Stardust has a habit of mocking his adversary. How can one counter that? Stardust is the jester of Jupiter, but how many clowns do you see being taken seriously? Don't hesitate to wipe the smile off his face. Brutal stomp to the body. And followed up by another to the chest. Kick to the gut creates separation. Oh, a short knee right to the body. Oh, look at this. Send him up. Oh, an inverted DDT. Caught with a punch. Oh, stiff punch. This is getting out of control. Steamboat has seen better days. Oh, what a hip toss. Great athleticism and a drop kick to finish. Steamboat is really feeling the hits here. Yeah, Steamboat has run into a roadblock. What a counter. Ricky isn't taking this lying down anymore. That might be what gets Steamboat out of jeopardy. from the Gord Buster. Headed to the top now. From the top. Blocked the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Oh. Swinging neck breaker connects. Oh. 
And he gets set back into the ring. Solely focused on in a corner. The legs are a base that you do not want to lose. Chopping down the tree at the base here. Dark matter. That's got to be it. There's two. Forces the shoulder up after two. How in the world did he kick out? Steamboat cuts him off. Being carried around with ease. Snake out. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Uh, the elbow drop to the knee. Oh, look at this, really softening up the leg. Nothing's gonna stop it. Really just laying it in. He's starting to struggle here. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. He turns it around. Defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. Lifting their opponent up. Double chicken wing applied and into the submission. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap. Look at this, he let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. Reversal. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. You might get caught. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Ooh, man. is really fired up. He's taking this to the floor now. Uh-oh. What a takedown. Fujiwara armbar. Ah, oh, Fujiwara armbar applied. Chest as well. Six. And a menacing look from Stardust. Action needs to return to the ring and fast. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. This isn't the smartest. Oh, he grew tired of his smug attitude. Flinged across the way. Suplex attempt. Able to go behind, though. From behind. Chop block. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Stop anybody. Ooh. Oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Effective arm drag. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? From the top. Elbow drop. Cover. Two. It's over. Brutality finally comes to an end. Here is your winner. Ricky Steamboat celebrating this well-deserved win. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now.
the WWE Universe on their feet. The following contest is a fatal four-way tag team ladder match and is for the NXT Tag Team Championship. Introducing first at a combined weight of 450 pounds, the Empire of Pain. Doesn't matter what you've done in the past, good or bad, frustrating or good, if you grab that contract, it all goes away and you change your future. This is going to be good. And their opponents first at a combined weight of 448 pounds. The faces. The majority of the people who've cashed in a contract over the years have become champion. And you can talk to every single one of them. They'll explain to you what it has meant to their lives, to their families' lives, to their career. We should also mention that there's plenty of ill will when it comes to these superstars. Which means these guys are likely more determined than ever to prove their superiority here tonight. They are ready for a fight. Making their way to the ring at a combined weight of 446 pounds. The NXT Tag Team Champions, The Club. Listen, there are so many superstars who spend months, years without getting a championship opportunity to enter a match of this nature, money in the bank, and to know once you capture that briefcase and the contract inside, you can cash in on the opportunity to truly become champion. DIY has arrived. One of the most beloved teams in WWE. And their opponents at a combined weight of 400 pounds. Tommaso Ciampa and Johnny Gargano. DIY. I've been fortunate enough to call many of the rules these two men have fought side by side and against each other. They are a fun team to watch. Two men who have been the heart and soul of NXT. They brought that same passion to the main roster and have quickly become a top team in the WWE. And we're about to see that passion on display. Multiple teams facing off here, but they're all headed in one direction. Up the ladder. The ultimate prize is 20 feet above the ring, gentlemen. Unfortunately, there's a few teams in the way. Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a 
submission maneuver. Getting it cinched in. Oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Ready to snap there. Jeez, that's got to hurt. Ladder matches are unpredictable. We all know that. But if you can pick your spots and prepare for the fact that you're going to endure punishment, you should be able to survive and hopefully come out on top. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's and now he's looking to lock in this submission. Submission. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. DDT. Kneeling. Knee right to the temple. Oh! What a cutter. Headlock. Just a dominant display. Champa gets countered there. Oh. Oh. Dodged right on cue. The challenger eating up some damage. of the opposition, climbed every rung, grabbed the prize, and earned their spot in history with this ladder match victory. No doubt about it, the better superstar definitely won tonight. We are about to see something good. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York. Weighing in at 100. 
130 pounds. Unpredictable. A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. With eyes full of wrath and fury, here comes Ilya Dragunov. And his opponent from Moscow, Russia, weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya You are looking at one of the hardest hitting competitors in NXT history. A man who's ready to unleash fury on the entire WWE roster. With that trademark unflinching gaze, there is no telling what's going through the mind of the czar of WWE. Taking out a competitor like Dragunov is always unnerving. Ilya Dragunov. Now, this young man says that pain makes him feel alive. He comes to the ring prepared to receive just as much damage as he doles out to his competition. Yeah, there's Relentless, and then there's Dragunov. He doesn't care what toll this match takes on his or his opponent's body, just as long as he comes out on top. A man driven by a relentless fury who attacks without hesitation. Ilya Dragunov is ready to fight here tonight but he'll be facing off against someone who is trying to shut down all the naysayers. Someone ready to claim a spot at the top of our business. Every strike more devastating than the last. Kroganov fires back. Bam! Just hot shot it to the outside. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Dominating shoulder tackle. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Shoulders down! Strong oh. kick out there. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. Oh, what a knee. <laughs> He's taking some good hits. Belly to belly. Into the pin attempt. He's able to kick out before two. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. Dragunov out of harm's way. And for Ilya Dragunov, it is about that philosophy. Umba Zikbar. The notion that he's undefeatable once he reaches a certain point. The question is, how does he get there? Well, it's this simple for Ilya Dragunov. Just keep fighting. Dragunov fights every day to prove his worth. Unba Zikbar isn't just something that sounds scary, it's something he's earned the right to call himself. That's a free fall. He's going for it all. From the top! Diving elbow drop, are you kidding me? And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Whoa. Working to neutralize that arm. Measured knee drop. And the man rushing, getting shut down with that move. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. I don't think there's any love lost here. 
Certainly seems that tensions are rising, Michael. I have a feeling we're only seeing the beginning, Byron. to a disadvantage now. And Dragunov stuck and looking for a solution. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. The adrenaline is... Well, that was a hard-fought victory there, and uh, his opponent's pretty hurt, I think. He's certainly hurt, but this superstar wants to inflict even more punishment. Now, come more on, what does he get out of this? What's the point? A little reminder. What an egomaniac. Yeah, now we're talking. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Weighing in at 295 pounds. Gorilla! All these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance. I can't wait to see what unfolds. This match has everyone backstage buzzing. He is an exciting competitor to watch. We are in the eye of the storm now. And his opponent weighing in at 215 pounds, the Hurricane. Let's be honest, guys. This guy has about as many superpowers as he does brain cells. You know what, Corey? It just seems like you are green with envy. Oh, my God. You did not go there. I did. You can see by the look on his face that he came here tonight to send a message. He's certainly determined to prove a point, and that's that he should be on top. Well, he has the opportunity to prove that point tonight, Corey. We'll see if he's all bark. And he's going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the one true superhero in all of WWE, the Hurricane. A more ridiculous man has never stepped through the ropes, Saxton. Not even you. Nevertheless, the Hurricane has managed to back up his tough talk on occasion. Plus, he's got guts and heart. Now, brains, I'll leave that to the people to decide. The Hurricane, oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. We're gonna find the escape from the abdominal stretch. Uh-oh, found it. What a beautiful moonsault. Not only does the standing moonsault physically hurt, but it's got to bruise the ego, too. And that toss got some hang time. It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Tossing them aside. Oh, what are they gonna do? Oh, look at this. Look at this power. No way. That powerbomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Vicious right forearm. And what is the proverbial weakness for the superhero Hurricane, Corey? 
Hurricane believes he can fly, and that goes a long way, but size and strength are a disadvantage no superpower can overcome. Hurra hit him hard, and don't Hurra stop. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. Whoa, not quite yet. Oh, look at this. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. Countered it just in time. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the face. My God. Hurricane messing with him. Clearly trying to force an error. Firm control. Oh, what a boot. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Yeah, he can pin his opponent right here. Gets his shoulder up. Dangerous territory for both athletes. The ring apron. Are you kidding me? Off the apron to the floor. A collision like that could mark a turn. Like a basketball. You have been caught. I am a hurricane. This storm is surging after that move. The Sexton's mic have a mute function. With Alaria. The competitive spirit is alive and well in this one. Yeah, I think these superstars are actually fairly eager to test themselves against one another. That means they recognize each other as being legitimate threats to their own ambitions. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Toss back into the ring. We're gonna lock it in here. Camel clutch. Someone's getting humbled. Uh, this one's over. Tap out coming. And he chooses to let go of the hold. But just the amount of time he was in that submission could be very significant. Taking flight. Diving body splash. This could do it. for you guys. Well, I was incredibly impressed by this superstar who... Uh -oh. oh, hang on, gentlemen. This superstar has entered the chat. A great deal of history between these two. And tensions are rising.
Hey, maybe we're gonna get a handshake. Yeah, I'm actually surprised if Superstar is extending his hand and... Well... Oh, oh wait! Things did not go as they planned. There was no reason. How disrespectful. Hey, maybe they shouldn't have taken the bait, right? And it's all about trying to embarrass the superstar's opponent in the early going. And as we just saw, emotions are clearly at a high in this one, guys. You don't have to like it, Cole, but you have to respect it. Well, I don't like it, and I definitely don't respect poor sportsmanship in WWE. How was that poor sportsmanship? We aren't here to hug, we're here to fight, Saxton. Oh. And that damage to the shoulder could be an ongoing factor now. It might limit range of motion in the entire arm. Oh, man, what a hit. Boom. And a drop kick. Picture perfect. Heading up, he's thinking back. From the top. Oh, no. Good God. Just a disgusting thud hurt here at ringside. Looking for the back suplex. Nope. Now he's been put on the defensive. Look at all these oh my God. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Taking off from the ropes. He can end it here. He's far from finished. Up and down the hard way. Oh, oh, oh gosh. He must have had that scouted. He turns it around. He's looking to get back in this. Brief sign of adrenaline there for him. And the neck breaker. Ah, look at this. Hard breaker. Looks like they're looking for a clover leaf. Into a back breaker. Fantastic. Treading all over their opponent. Great counter. You know what? Uh oh. Back and forth. Up and over. The pendulum beginning to shift. Boom! This superstar is something else. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Close to three. Taken down. What is this superstar looking for? Legs are great by now. The arms are trapped. This won't end well. Oh, big stop. Cover. Is it enough? Kicks out. And you got to think he's just one fight blow away from not kicking out next time. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. To the eyes. Desperate counter. Crucial turnaround there because he was falling behind. Could be what he needed to ignite a rally. He is just reeling from that offense. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. He's got the answer for that one. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. And a carefully measured knee drop. Up and down the hard way. Oh, here he goes for the win. 
Danny close it out. Breaks the close count. Now obviously still has some fight left. Oh, target in the arm. This has got to hurt. Knew what was coming there. Methodically targeting the arm. A unique offense in store here. Dragon Sleeper applied. Oh, my God, from the top rope. Dragon Sleeper locked in. Oh, my God. Shoulders down. No, stops the count at two. Almost inhuman at this point. He may be in a bad way here. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Double leg takedown. Step through looking for a submission here. Legs are locked up. Uh-oh. Oh, big stop. All eyes focused on this absolute roar. It doesn't get more masterful than this. Setting it up. Boom. He's got him in the crosshairs. Looking for the rip cord. Oh, man, what a knockout. That's his going nice to the cover. Can he finish this off? It is enough. Finally, it's over. Here is your winner, Mr. Jimmy. They refuse to let the disrespect get to them, and now they are standing tall. Definitely kept their head clear in this one. Who knows, maybe this win will grant them the respect that was clearly denied of them earlier. Hopefully that's not still weighing on their mind. They just won. That's all that matters in the long run. The best in the world. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois. Weighing in at 218 pounds, C.M. Punk. Who could forget the night of Punk's historic return? But now, Punk must prove himself. Says he's now home, but many competitors have said this is no longer his home. Punk has never been more focused. He's now down to business, and he wants to rewrite his legacy and write a whole new chapter in the WWE. Punk's return was an amazing moment, but now he must capitalize. Yeah, easier said than done because the competition is now at an all-time high. Is being the best in the world still good enough? Oh, yeah, I am pumped for this guy.
and his opponent from Kansas City, weighing in at 285 pounds, Bannon Cullen. You know, I know for a fact that there are a number of people in the locker room who dread getting in the ring with this superstar. Well, Byron, every superstar in that locker room is being paid to compete, so spare me the sob story. He has a big match ahead of him. Going to need a career-making performance here tonight. There's the bell and more evidence that hell has frozen over. CM Punk is all set for action. A lot of people never thought CM Punk would return, me included. But it's great to see him back in the WWE ring. I'm sure he used his time away to hone and perfect his game. There's no doubt that Punk worked on improving himself in every sense. The second city Saint is difficult to compete with. And he is up against someone who is determined to get the win here no matter what. As both men should be, Saxton. If you're not trying to win, you're not trying. Period. Drop kick! Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Puck never saw that coming. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Adding a level of insult with that kind of physicality. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Oh my god, that's gotta hurt. Just a flagrant display of aggression to do something. Uh oh! Uh oh! Suicide dive! That's playing fast and loose with your own body. You're a by Fuck! He turns it into the Anaconda Vice. This one could be over. Well, this won't. A couple of knees there. That'll get him out. Handle. Not that CM Punk thinks he needs it, but any words of advice for the veteran competitor, Corey? Stick with what has brought you to the dance. Strike with your innovative offense every chance you get. He is delivering elbow after elbow. And this match will head back to the ring. Oh, man, you can see he is feeling it now. Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, count's running out. He's back in so close to a count out. You do not want to lose that way. Boom! The Gulak attack. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Oh, man, right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. And that can end up putting CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Falcon arrow. Climbing up top. He's got big plans. Perched up top. He is still in this. And a drop kick. Picture perfect. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Oh, sharp knee. Boom. To the back of the neck. Side. He gets back into the ring. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Six. High red district for CM Punk. 
What are you guys thinking? Obviously, up high. Oh, wait a second. Caught in mid Well measured. Shifts it back onto him. See by any means. Oh, shoulder, elbow, all affected with that. Oh. And stopping away in the corner. Just ruthless. Sight set on the top rope. Pump from up high. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. He avoids the damage. Uh oh! And the knees! Nobody hits that one better. Two! He stays alive, he stays alive. Unbelievable. I thought Punk was done for sure. Never underestimate the resiliency of the second city saint. It is unreal that this match is still going on after a maneuver that would end most matches. Able to elude it. And this was quite the win for CM Punk. CM Punk is here to make money, and there's no better way to make money in this business than to win.